Less than 50 votes decided the election the last time these two candidates squared off. Good evening. I'm Matt Davenport. Thanks for watching. Primary season is fast approaching its end with voters going to the polls this coming Tuesday. Today, our Logan McDougal made his way to Bingham County to speak with the candidates for Bingham County Sheriff. Logan. Well, Matt, this race features two candidates who have faced each other in elections past. Sheriff Dave Johnson and Craig Rowland have met before on the campaign trail. The two locked political horns in 2004 with Johnson winning by a less than 50 vote margin. I feel like I understand a lot of his strengths. I think he understands a lot of mine. Uh, I think it's up to the people to decide who they want running the sheriff's office. I think it's a lot different than it was eight years ago. Uh, strictly for the reason eight years ago I was the chief deputy and I had someone running against me and you know, I was probably going to lose my job if I lost. On the campaign trail this time around, these were the issues they said they were hearing from voters. Well, I think the biggest thing is the, is the barriers and, and the communications. You know, they don't know what's going on in the sheriff's office. They, they don't feel like the sheriff's office is approachable, and, and I think they want that to change. We've been very, very active in removing uh, a lot of drugs off our streets, out of our community. And I think people appreciate that. They appreciate us being out and about. And when asked why they should receive your vote, the men had this to say. What have been able to accomplish since I've been a sheriff in Bingham County? Bringing, bringing the agency together as a team and working together as a team in, in all the departments within uh, the sheriff's office. I think the biggest reason is I want to bring back the communications and cooperations to the sheriff's office. Take those barriers down that, that uh, the public has with the sheriff's office right now and get more involved in the public and uh, just be a, a better community type sheriff. Now be sure to tune in to KPVI News 6 and KPVI.com next Tuesday for all your East Idaho primary coverage. Matt, back to you.